Before he became Prime Minister in 2022, Anwar Ibrahim promised to govern for the common people. However, this is not the experience of this group of small farmers in the Prime Minister's own electorate. Well, he was looking for different political parties, um, like the MCA, which is the Malayan Chinese Association, and then eventually uh, the DAP, Democratic Action Party. And uh, none of them actually responded to any of the farmers. Yeah. Uh, Okay. So the, the, the story started in the sense that uh, Dr. Kumar, mainly BSM, helped, us, uh, look for, helped him at that time to look for a lawyer. And the lawyer started, um, we started of course at the Ipoh court, at the state level. Uh, it was a long process, we went up to, um, to the federal court. And then at the end of the federal court, at the appeals, they, they told, they told um, the judge told both sides. They have to go back and negotiate, but uh, apparently the opposing party, which is a government-linked company, hasn't done that yet. When Okay. So obviously, uh, again, the opposing party did not come back, uh, did not respond, so the farmers are still farming till today. Yeah. Put 有点好的希望。He said he will tell Anhua um, to take care of all the races, but not from particular one particular races. He say as a farmer, it's a hard earned money for them. They they actually uh, it's a very hard work. They should deserve a better treatment. The lives of these hard-working small farmers remain clouded in uncertainty in the electorate of the Prime Minister himself.